Joe Bryan, he's caught out David Raya. One swing of the Joe Bryan, he's caught out David Raya. Cheese, loads of cheese. <laughs> What's up, boys, and welcome to the award winner Joe, Joe Bryan, Bryan, aka he's caught out the Foulham hero himself. They have gone up to the champion. Uh, they have gone up to the Premier League. A two hundred and seventy-five million dollar trophy. If you look at it that way, if you come from the Championship and go up to the Premier League, it is a massive, massive achievement. Not only from a performance perspective, uh, uh, winning out on the grueling, grueling season that is the Championship, one of the most competitive leagues, uh, one of the mo one of the most competitive leagues in the world, uh, and then making it up into the Premier League, joining Leeds United. And I'm forgetting who the second team is. Don't roast me. I just got a lot of things going on right now. But congratulations is the first thing I want to say to Fallaham supporters uh, and then the other thing I do want to say it's uh, it's not a, it's not how you act when you lose it's your the way that you act when you win so um, I think you know if you're a Fallaham supporter you know a Brentford you know, great performance. I don't think the keeper deserves the stick that he's gotten. It, it, I mean I, I read I read something saying that Joe Bryan looked at some uh, looked at some looked at some tape and noticed that that keeper uh, Raya does come off uh, the line quite often and uh, that is something that he looked at but the absolute cheat dare I say it the absolute audacity for Joe Bryan to attempt that goal uh, literally was the thing that uh, put uh, put foul him through and he also scored the second goal in 77 appearances prior to this one he had scored I think one or two goals he scores two in the most important game of foul uh most recent uh, most recent matches so hats off Literally, hats off to Joe Bryan, absolute freaking legend, and this is why we got his card, because he was a hero in that match, uh, a 94-rated Joe Bryan card that uh, requires only an 84-rated squad, which is 100k, but today, we are going to look at this card, we're going to play him up top with Mitrovic, the Serbian legend himself, uh, who, it was crazy in that game for his own, right, he literally grabbed a guy threw him to the ground, and I think Falham were still able to take the free kick, which is just mind-boggling to me. But, like I always say, boys, if you guys do enjoy the episode, is that they help you in some way, shape, or form, drop a mad lad like on the video. If you guys are a Falham supporter, drop a mad lad like on the video. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button down below. So, it is a 600 total in-game, 600 plus total in-game stat upgrade over his silver card, which is what he has, obviously, before. Has a three-star, four-star weak foot. I miss, uh, I, I incorrectly said that he got a four-star weak foot upgrade. He's had the four-star weak foot on his silver card. High medium work rates, left footed, and just some ridiculous, ridiculous stats. I mean, for, for it being October, it better have been. And it looks like 100K is going to be around that price for the players that are like 94, 95 plus rated. I think that's what we can expect going forward. Um, 96 acceleration, 95 sprint speed with the anchor. Kemstal gets that jacked off. Attacking positioning is 93, which is representative of how he played in the game. Has, sh has shooting power, has long shots, has curve. The only thing that I don't understand... Is, and, and I know EA don't have full control over, like, a, there's a formula that, that goes into changing how a card plays, or, or or the card stats. I wish EA could go ahead and manipulate it and give him 99 free kicks, because, like, really, what did he get this hero card for? For that incredible, incredible free kick. So, yeah, a card that literally was a hero for something that he didn't game, and he doesn't even get the accurate stats. So that would be something that would be cool to see in FIFA 21. Uh, dribbling stats are pretty cracked. Composure's a little bit mad with the finishing, um, and then the defending stats. I mean, like, this is really just a nuts card. 99 stamina with 86 aggression, 80 80, uh, 80, uh, sorry, uh, 86 strength with 80 aggression. And then, of course, if you're using him, you got to play him alongside Alexander Mitrovic. So what we're going to do is we're going to switch the 4-4-2 in game. I'm actually going to be running him as an LCM, uh, a forward playing LCM. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to formations. I've got Joe Bryan here, but the instruction that I'm going to put on him is... Uh, get forward because that's exactly what he did right so get forward if you're doing the joe Bryan hero episode of course you got to run the Fallum and the brentford kits um damn dude brentford that's unlucky man you want you want to know what was very disappointing for those of you guys that watched it i i, I saw some uh, i saw some write-ups about the game ben rahima apparently played very poorly wasn't he meant to be like a huge transfer also fun little fact uh joe Bryan's father he's a cardiac surgeon specializing specializing in aortic surgery that's why you're subbed to this channel. The best description I could find about Joe Bryan is how Joe Bryan acted in that game is pretty much how every left back or right back in pro clubs plays. When your team desperately needs a goal, <laughs> it's like legitimately how I play in, in pro clubs with Nep and the boys. So far, the 83 finishing and the 82 composure is, you know, kind of, Hernandez. kind of expect that. Wasn't expecting a crazy finish. Go on, 
Mitro? The Serbian Matlad himself? Famous for his own little, uh, like I had alluded to earlier, literally just grabbed the guy and threw him to the ground, and the ref still gave foul him the, 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 the free kick. I don't understand. Go to Ryan. That's a good goal. It's, God, it makes me so mad. It makes me so mad! I literally can't tackle. Joe Bryan! He's caught to the seven Ryan! That's kind of reminiscent of the goal that he scored. That's kind of, that's actually very reminiscent of the second goal that he scored to seal it. There's something about Joe Bryan that's a little bit magical. There's just something about Joe Bryan that's a little bit magical. He's been involved in pretty much every goal that we've scored so far. Dad ass. Yeah, I feel like this card. I feel like I feel like Bryan's probably wasted. Yeah, Bryan's card is for sure wasted at wing back. Okay. Joe Bryan! He's caught out David Raya! Nice dribbling. Alex Mitrovic. Oh my god! Look at the make pass. And then Mitro with the four star week? Go on, man! Serbia OP! He hasn't missed yet, he's two for two. What an absolute psychomaniac, dude! If you're if you're a Brentford if you're if you're a Brentford supporter, you absolutely hate this guy. This guy in the Premier League next season is gonna be a chore to defend. Joe Bryan. He he does he doesn't have the finishing. You know what? We probably should have gone with a different chem style. We're having him make all these runs. We probably should have gone with a different chem style, but he does have di look, dude. His his dribbling is mad. And he holds on to the ball too. Nice, Joe Bryan. That's trash. I'll say this, Mitrovic has been the best player that we've used across, uh, including, um, okay, Joe Bryan's been really good defensively, missed a couple chances, obviously probably didn't put the right chem style, but Alexander Mitrovic has been the best player that we've used. Vignaldo, Wilfred Zaha, Giorgino Vignaldo, passe bastante peligroso para romper... Joe Bryan! Oh my god! He can't finish for his life! He can't do what he was given his hero card for. He can't do what he was. He can't do what he was 50% given his hero card for. I am playing. I don't, I don't know if it's because it's August, but I'm just playing absolute trash. I'm playing absolute horrible footy. Here we go, lad. Norberto Neto is one of the worst keepers I've ever used. Oh my god. Cool story, bro. Joe Bryan! Joe Bryan, dude, he's just, he's everywhere. 
Oh, he's off. He's off. I'm raging like mad because my defense is giving him the ball. Joe Bryan! He's caught out David Raya! Let's go, boys! That's the sort of finish we're looking for. Going for your close up. Show them that you've been to the dentist, boys. Josh Magic, what a goal. What a goal from Josh Magic. Go on, lad. Hey, he deserves it. That's an absolute banger. Bernardo Silva. Atento que se viene la contra. Gran ocasión de pared, papá. Y así le pega la pelota. Han logrado terminar. Look. I don't want this card to go up in any I don't want this card to go over 90,000 points. What what's Mitro up to? Mitrovic is up to what is he right now? His live price is 90,000 coins. He's gone up to 120,000 coins on the PS. He's gone up to 120,000 coins on the PS. He spiked literally 23. He spiked about 20 or 30,000 coins on the PS strictly. I think because of this card. Mitro. Who other than Mitro? It's never anyone other than freaking Mitrovic, boys. Joe Bryan! He's caught out David Raya! Oh, come on, Brian! Let's go, lad! He shushed me! We converted a shush to a dub with the hero Joe Bryan. Let's go, boys! Foul ham hero, and dare I say it, we're in December. It's a ridiculous, ridiculous card. Sure, they could have jacked off maybe the weak foot, given him five star, maybe even given him some skill moves, give him four star, four star, increase the free kick accuracy to what he actually got the card for, which was one of the most memorable free kicks that I have ever seen, um, especially for what it meant in the game, meaning that Falham got pr promoted in the Premier League. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and give this four out of five in terms of value. I am also going to give it four and a half. Uh, I'm also gonna give it four out of five uh, Infinity Gauntlet fingers in terms of on the pitch performance. Uh, it has the agility, is not lacking anything that you would want outside of maybe finishing. You know, you can put the right chem style on him, but I feel like you're probably gonna want to play him either uh, private LCM, RCM. Could really play many places on the pitch. You can bump him out. He's got the stamina to play of uh, wing back. He's got the stamina to play fullback. He can play, you know, defensively. He can play attacking minded. You just have to find the right chem style for him. And for me, the anchor really does the trick uh no matter where you play him but if you do want him more in a more attacking role i would suggest uh something that gets his uh gets the shooting and composure up a little bit more but just a really really great little card and honestly for me this was just a fun epi to do in honor of the foul boys because you guys just have made it up to the premier league and this is just really a round of applause to you guys and just to uh honor the achievement um honor the achievement the last of the promo uh, promoted squads to go up into the prem will be very excited to see how they play in uh in the big leagues but that's going to be the episode here, boys if you have enjoyed drop a like on the video if you guys are new to the channel Hit that subscribe button down below. Till next time, my bros. Choose later. Ade.